Hello, my name is Dr. Döpner from the University of Göttingen, Germany. Stroke is one of the most devastating diseases with a high social and economic burden in industrial countries. With the onset of recanalizing strategies such as thrombolysis and thrombectomy, stroke outcome has been improved significantly. Unfortunately, the majority of our patients does not qualify for either treatment paradigm. And that is the reason why a great deal of researchers and scientists is looking for new therapeutic options in order to have a better stroke outcome of our stroke patients worldwide. This is where it comes to the MERSAS-2 trial. Preclinical data has already shown that transplantation of adult stem cells results in a better neurological performance after a stroke. MASTERS-1 did a remarkable job of identifying and picking the possible subgroups of patients that would benefit from stem cell therapy. And we are now excited to see the actual effects on these individuals in MASTERS-2. Such an extension of a therapeutic time window, in addition to already established recanalizing strategies, may indeed help improve the outcome of our stroke patients. There will be a high demand in treatments in stroke is a common and frequently seen disease in elderly. Lastly, and most importantly, the patients benefit with an improved outcome and hopefully less morbidity and mortality after stroke. The fascination of the MASTERS-2 trial lies in its different therapeutic concept in comparison to the recanalizing strategies that I've just mentioned before. Multistem offers a broad therapeutic time window by modulating the brain's own regeneration capacity. If approved in the clinic, such a concept might revolutionize modern stroke treatment, where patients will receive intravenous infusions of multistem product stored in the blood bank after we canalizing stroke therapy.